All right. <laughs> Intake, exhaust, TSB tune. Intake, down pipe, front pipe, exhaust, intercooler, variable tune. So mine's basically full bolt on. I, I say full bolt on because I mean, the, the turbo inlet piping doesn't do anything other than sound until you upgrade the turbo. So, full bolt on, tuned, versus intake, intake exhaust, tuned. I already know the difference in the outcome power-wise, but I definitely want to see how it is, like, on the street. This is just for educational purposes. Going <laughs> <Go> to dinner. <laughs> I, would, I really just want to see the difference between downpipe and intercooler versus stock downpipe and intercooler that was actually a decent comparison because people are going to ask is our downpipes worth it and then and this would and if our downpipes and intercooler is worth it this will definitely summarize the question right there yeah. your tsp tune max output is on sport mode right like that's the max it does yeah so is that my map three because my map three is about 23 24 psi i would say yes on the max so we're going to be doing two races we're going to be doing a f you want to do a 30 roll we can do a 30 roll map one non-sport and then we can do a 30 sport map three there it is so the first one's going to be my map one and him on not sport mode they're both going to be basically pushing 19 psi that would probably that's actually a really good comparison right there yeah. so and then the next race is going to be another 30 roll, but we're, he's going to be pushing it on sport mode, which is 23 PSI. I'm going to be on map three, which is about 23, 24 PSI. Again, TSP, fairable. So to be fair, I won't be in sport mode either then. So this race may or may not be delayed. I think that car up there is a cop. Do you think that's a cop? Might be. We've been out here. We'll go check. I'll be back. Okay. So let's just do 30 rolls right here then. Huh? 30 roll? Yeah. I'll follow you when we do a U-turn, okay? Okay. PSI. Now I have to switch maps. That was not bad. Map, map one, 19 PSI. That's probably the best comparison you'll get out of the two because they're both 19 PSI. They're both in not sport mode. And at that difference, you're just looking at the tune and the parts. So I'm pretty sure I pulled harder because of my downpipe. Intercooler, obviously, as well. I slowed down because I saw somebody right there and sure enough that brake boost made a difference that was a good race. your brake boost I didn't brake boost you did I did but I couldn't get it to boost like it would go in and out in and out and I'm like fuck so when I I don't know I don't even know who honked I think I did oh, okay. well, no I think I, you did at that last one I think I finally got it and I was like fuck it let's go I stopped that a certain amount of number because I thought I saw somebody on the left side there was somebody. which there was yeah. down pipe and intercooler definitely worth it yeah I was definitely reeling you in. Yes. But I, but I stopped. 
Yeah, and that second race, I didn't brake boost. Really? At all, yeah. I, yeah. I, 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 you honked before I, before I could get into so it. So without you brake boosting, that was the difference? Yes, big time. Jesus. Yeah, it was, <laughs> it was considerable because you just, it walked. So if I brake boosted... It would make a difference. <laughs> it would definitely make a difference. <laughs> I didn't brake boost at all. So, but yeah, that is a pretty good comparison right there. So, is a downpipe and an intercooler worth it? Yes. Definitely 100%. As soon as he hit peak boost with the brake boost, he was able to keep up. But slowly and surely, I was going to pass you. You were coming. You were You were definitely coming. Hold on. Aha. But you didn't come fast enough. Oh. No, so. definitely intercooler. Or not even the intercooler, but front pipe, down pipe. The down pipe was the one that made the biggest difference for me power-wise. Yes. Because you, you can tell it just by daily driving it. Because jumping in from yours to mine, you can tell the difference big time. But the intercooler did help with the temperatures, which helped me do the consistent pulls. Yes. That's one thing I can tell you. But the downside about my intercooler is that you get more lag. I do have more lag. Yeah. Definitely have more lag. That's going to be it for today's video, guys. Um not bad not bad at all i was really thinking it was going to be a huge difference but honestly this is probably a really good comparison on stock downpipe and stock intercooler versus aftermarket downpipe and aftermarket in intercooler so like i mentioned in my other video i do have the Faribault tune and he does have the tsp tune they're both the i guess you can say the stage one tune the 1.5 tune yeah, the 1.5 the tune power wise shouldn't be too much difference if we were both stock the power wise is only going to be different from the aftermarket parts considering they're both rivals in tuning and they both do similar powers on stock form so to say how much we are pushing we don't know yet i actually have a dyno lined up very soon i'm gonna email the guy and see if i can do it next monday because okay. he said he wasn't available today that's the only reason why uh oh so we should see how much i'm actually pushing and we'll go from there so I will see you guys in another video. You guys have a good day. Peace. Peace.